Hey, hey, we're back, Coon Prairie Ramblers, and we got a... This is the F-bomb, isn't it? It's I'm time. afraid so. Oh, is that time already, Holy ladies cow. and gentlemen? So, Jump and so y'all assume mm-hmm. the position, because here she comes again. Ready? I'm here going. we go. Doing bombs. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> F, F, F. You may already have already ifed this yourself, mm-hmm. but we, we haven't, so we're going to talk about it. I'm kind of iffy it. about it. If, uh, that's good to be iffy. If you were going to get a tattoo, oh, or, no. or another tattoo, if you already got 47 of them, or how many here you got? If you were going to get a tattoo, if, you know, if it was your first tattoo, if you were going to get your first tattoo for the first well, time. Well, none of us have it, do we? Well, not that I know of. No, I ain't got one. No, I ain't got one. I, don't, I kind of test okay. right. I ain't We're all been, okay. tattoo virgins. Okay. I've never been skinny dip with these guys, so I can't, I can't attest to any tattoos. That reminds me of another story I'll tell you in a minute. But anyway, if you were going to get a tattoo for the first time, what would you get, and where would it be? What would it be about? Well, when we started this segment, mm-hmm. I just thought of the perfect one for the mailman. Oh, yeah? The mailman oh, tattoo. On his forearm. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Jumping Jehoshaphat. Jumping Jehoshaphat. <laughs> Jumping Jehoshaphat. Well, that's what he said. So I thought to myself, I I said, that he could. Oh, he said that? Yeah, yeah. he said Jumping Jehoshaphat. Jumping Jehoshaphat. So, you know, he was in the Bible. Actually, I said Jumping Jehoshaphat. Jehoshaphat. Well, Jumping Jehoshaphat was in the Bible. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It's from a verse in the Bible. Yeah. So you could put the verse. He was jumping? Was he jumping in the Bible? Yeah. Huh. What? Yeah. He's trying to get away from you know, God. I thought stuff. y'all read the book. I trouble. thought y'all read the book. You're He's trying to get away from God or something? No, that, that's true. Well, I can tell you what, they sure never preach about him. Well, you ever heard the, uh, about the dry bones? That's in the Bible. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, Ezekiel, writing on the wall. Ezekiel, oh, yeah. Worm food. And the, yeah. The, all these. Uh, and all these the, and the bears jumping out of the woods killing those kids. Yeah. Yeah. And the because ass, they called the old man bald. And the ass talking. I mean, yeah, yeah. That's right. I've heard a lot of them in my yeah, time. Yeah, this is pre- a political I, season, so I actually, you're all over the place. I actually preached on that. Yeah, man. I said if uh, I figured if I if I could speak to people, I could too. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Have mercy. Wait a minute. We're on t- we better get hey, back on Sunday. If, we're gonna run okay, out of time. If we were going to get a tattoo. tattoo where would you get tatted? Now, I, it, I, people that are really into getting tattoos. Yeah. They don't call it tattoos. They call it body art. Body. Had to go get. I just had to get me some ink. I just had to go get me some ink. I yeah, heard people say that. Ink like, up. Give me a break. Uh, you got a problem. <laughs> you got to get one because they say if you want one, you're gonna want another one. Yeah. Is that right? Well, I ain't gonna get that. the first one. Then. It's addictive. What would you really? get, mailman? You pro- if you get one, you're probably feeling guilty. Like it's it's such a lousy one that I got to make up for that one and get a better one. That or you oh. show it off and then you get all this great attention, and after a while that wanes, and then you yeah, want more attention. So right. I better go get another one. Yeah, that's what it is. My brother had on his wrist, on the inside of his wrist, he had cut here. Doug. No, I'm kidding. He said his name was Doug, and it said Doug. Well, one day I was visiting Doug, Doug and, and I looked at it had a big old eagle there. I said, Doug, you you put the eagle over top of Doug. Why'd you do that? You he says, I don't want the people to know who I am. That's what you Paranoia. do the, in the beginning. Of course, it was nice to so, have see, it there. He had to cover up one because he was ashamed of the other one. Remember, he ever lost his arm. They'd know, well, this must be Doug's arm. Oh, would you be ashamed for a guy, one of them guy named Doug. Well, he didn't. Doug was a very, he never had his mail come to he always sent his mail to my mom's house wherever he was living he was always living with some girl that paranoia or what and he he just didn't want the he didn't want the the, the bill collectors <laughs> to know where he lived a smart man yeah. go doug and one time i called him up and says and uh he said hello i i and i just i didn't think i was doing that great of a job of disguising my voice but then you know i, I said this is a bill collector click and all of a sudden he said judy judy take this phone take this phone <laughs> judy judy <laughs> Judy, Judy, Judy. He believed me. And I was just wow. a teenage kid, yeah. Anyway. Tattoos. Tattoos. <laughs> what kind of what, I'm hearing crickets. You're going to get tattooed with a cricket? I, I've never. I think I would get something that uh, showed my native heritage. Native heritage. Hair. I think I would get a, like a band heritage. around my oh, arm. heritage. My forearm. Yeah. yeah. I figure there's no use getting like, one up above your sleeve. I like mean, some... Indian feathers hanging Feather, down. Yeah, right. exactly. A bird feathers hanging down. Or maybe down. a... Uh, such thing as Indian feathers. Would you have canaries or eagle? Eagles. Oh. Because you may not know this, Native Americans are the only people that may legally possess eagle feathers. That's right. Do you have to be 100% Native American? 
I can have one. Well, now, how do they get that? Oh, because we're Native Americans. That we're not. Right. Uh, same and we're infidels. What do we? We get to no, have turkey illegals. feathers, right? You can get buzzard feathers. Buzzard feathers. That'd be my luck. Chicken feathers. But I yeah. think that's what I would Chicken get. Feathers. I would get something like that. Or I, Horse feathers. I may uh, get a Bible verse, maybe. Mm-hmm. About mounting a, up a on long like, one or a short one. Of no, I think mine would just Jesus be simple. Jesus wept. And then no, would, put a mine would be uh, under it. simply, my grace is sufficient for you. Yeah. That's a good one right there. Yeah. I've often thought I wanted a tattoo. I've thought about it over the years. Well, I'm going to get one one of these days, but just had never really settled on what I wanted. And now I'm an old man, so I don't know if I'd want one to begin with. But my father had a very large one on his arm, one of these big mm-hmm. sailing ships with mm-hmm. all the... The, the big sails and all. Yeah. So it's had a big, kind of the Coast Guard. Yeah, it was really, really, really cool. Yeah. But uh, and I thought that made me want one. And, and I thought over the years, in the last year or two, I decided if I ever wanted one, I'd probably go with something to do with my football team, like a big horseshoe. Yeah. The Indianapolis Colts. used to be Baltimore Colts. Yeah. yeah. But put them on. Yeah, put them cool. on. Yeah. Yeah. I'd like Where, to have the. On up where you can see it or up here? Uh, here. I don't know. You're right because you put it up here and yeah. nobody's going to see it. But then yeah. again, you don't want everybody to see it anyway. Yeah. I, I think, think it, if, it's a, if it's an act of expression, put it where somebody can see it. But yeah. people think less of you if you have a tattoo. Sometimes. My father had one, but nobody hardly ever saw it. But it was on his shoulder, and it was of a United States Marine Corps symbol. Yeah, that's a cool one right there. My my dad had a hula girl on his forearm, and he, <laughs> he could make, he could her, make dance. her dance. He could make her dance, but as he got older, she sagged. Oh. You see a lot of these guys with these. Well, he can hold his arm upside down. Yeah, upside down. That's what reverse it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> But I've seen a lot of guys who had like naked women up and down their arms mm-hmm. or whatever. And as old yeah. men, I, I, I wonder if they ever had regrets of that. Or mermaids and they're yeah. half naked, stuff like that. Yeah. But, but some people, uh, uh, Casey and I grew, grew up at Nocky there. And we had plenty of people doing their own with, with, with needles. And then yeah. they, Jailhouse. They, 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 yeah. they would do love on one hand and, uh-huh. and hate on the other. For, for They'd the, take for the, two matches yep. and put a needle between them and then tie a string to tie them together. Uh-huh. <laughs> they would do that like and they but up and down their arms and stuff like that. And, looked, and they had they initials were, that were. I always remember the initials never were like really straight. No, and they had periods. You know, they would be like like uh, M period J period, and, mm-hmm. the, and the M would be kind of yeah. <laughs> short legged with one of them, and the J would have its uh, the old wompy jaw, wompy yeah. jaw. And, that's right. And I always thought, you know, if that's what I need for a tattoo, I don't want one of those. I, I, I never understood why people put them on their back where they can't see them. That's what I say. Put it where you can see yeah. it. Yeah, that's right. It may not even anyway. be what you thought it was. They you get it on your back. They put anything on there. Hey, did you ever see the movie with Rod Steiger, the Illustrated Man? Yeah. I heard about it. He was tattooed yeah. from head to foot. Yeah, he was tattooed all over. And what it was, they was uh, there was this other guy in the movie, and some, it was a really weird movie because he get to looking at the tattoo. And each tattoo to- stole a tor- told a story. Told a st- stole a story. Stole a story. Had a Tory in it, too? Yeah. Must have been made and, back uh, during Revolutionary times. And uh, so they'd go off into another story. And finally, at the end of the movie, can I tell you what happened? Sure. The, the go guy, ahead, got, the guy went That's crazy right. that, was, that was looking at the tattoo, so he killed the guy. He killed Brad Steiger. Did he skin him? <laughs> Burning big lampshades yeah. out of his skin. Well, you know, there's a, a TV show on now that where the woman was left in the middle of Times Square, and they opened the bag, and she's totally naked, and what? she's tattooed from from her neck to yeah. her feet. So you can't see nothing anyway. And there's got so many yeah, tattoos on. And they're clues, and each one of these little clues solves some sort of crime. So she can't take her clothes off, or what? Or put them oh, on? She has to. She can't put them back on. She has to to solve the crime. Well, they're reaching for for a story now, ain't they? Yeah. It's kind of interesting. It's interesting, but it's one of those shows that I hate because you have to follow it from week to week. If you miss a week, Uh, you're out, you know? Yeah, I don't like that either. You know, if I was ever on the show Naked and Afraid, it'd be nice to have a whole bunch of tattoos. Because then when you go, you're coming across the beach and you're meeting the person you're going to spend the... The day with, or the you know, a week or twenty weeks, three weeks. weeks. Three weeks. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> be, well, they're gonna blur it out anyway. Yeah, for the TV show. Well, the thing is, you can't. You put so many tattoos on it, it, it's it's camouflages everything. Hopefully, yeah. But who wants to put tattoos there? Yeah, <laughs> you're talking some major pain, <laughs> hey, man. Hey, you know these people the into body expression. You know, no, knock me it's, out. It's first. art. Hey, you get a, a Prince Albert. 
<laughs> what? <laughs> I know you don't want to know. Prince Albert in the can? Yeah, no, you don't want to know. <laughs> mm. Don't ask that's him, a, don't that's tell. a piercing. Let's just put it that way. Oh. Yeah, because some people, some people don't stop with the tattoos. They yeah. get enough of them, they're going to go ahead and have well, horns put on top and, of their heads. And, and what happens when you get all tattooed up and you can't do no more? You run out of room. What are you going to so do? So what happens? There? Do you erase you some to your children? Chil- you tattoo your children. Come here, oh, you. Yeah. Yeah. We're shaving the cat. Come here, cat. <laughs> <laughs> the illustrated family. With you never did say cat. what you're going to get on your tattoo. Yeah. Uh, I'm, I'm, trying, I'm still thinking. Um the mailman? The mailman? Uh, no, no, I ain't going to put no names. He's going to put vote for mail. That's what he's going to do. Pay for the clip. That's right. I approve this message. Yeah. Well, it wouldn't be a scripture because scripture tells you not to not to do that to your body. Back in You're right, the, it does. Do, do, do the wrong, it I mean. also says, by his stripes. We are. We are healed. So, so I should put some stripes on? Stars and stripes. That's what I should do. Yeah, you could have a... I could be a walking flag and everybody would salute me. How about a big Confederate flag? And, I, you know, and there's a thing. There's a, I've, got a, there, I've got a question I'm going to ask when I get to heaven. Because I've asked a lot of preachers and nobody's ever been able to explain this to me. Jesus had a tattoo. I heard about it. It says so. Yeah, you told us that one time. Revelation. It's on his thigh. Yeah. On his thigh. It mm-hmm. says. Yeah. So it had to be tattooed. Yeah. Well, he surely he didn't tape a little note down well, there. Well, he was allowed to have one, then. That's right. So what what did it say? Lord, Lord, and King, King? I don't know Lord, what it said. King, keep, keep on trucking or something. I don't know <laughs> sure what it said. Keep on the firing line. Keep on the fire. That's a good but one. But I'd like to there. know about that. I'd tell him. I'd definitely yeah. like to know about that. Okay. A tattoo. Tattoo. I wonder, did, did, you still did, haven't told did us. Did tattoo have a tattoo on? It'd be a short one if it was. Oh. You never did say yet. What you're well, saying. I'm still trying to think of one. It wouldn't be a scripture. It wouldn't be a teardrop. And we've got 30 seconds left. And well, you better hurry it would cough, be a, it would be a clock. It would be a surreal clock like a Salvador Dali. That's what it would be. Oh, well, one is melting, dripping, dripping off of my shoulder. One of floppy clocks. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Now the question is, what time would it be? I don't know. It's time to get on out of here because our time is up for the week, boys and girls. We're going to have to get out of here. And what is the frequency, Kenneth? 1480 WFLN on your radio dial. News radio. And we'll be back the same place next week.